What is up guys, Max here, and today we're just walking around. Today's video is being shot on a 50 millimeter lens, which means it's way too close to my face, but I don't have any other options. I need to get new lenses. But today we're going to B&H Photo to buy some stuff we probably don't need to buy. But hey, anyways, I like that store, so let's get to it. Enjoy the montage. Roll tape. back thank you for watching that little montage I hope you enjoyed it I know I enjoyed filming it and to be completely honest it's probably more for me than anybody else I enjoy taking my camera out and just putting things together that lets me edit it's like meditation for me so that's all I got to say about that but we did get some stuff from B&H and I'm gonna show you what it is first we've got this cool Manfrotto tripod from B&H um, I picked it up because I thought it was useful and that's one of the things we got. Next, we got this Jobby UltraFit sling strap. I will go into more detail in a later video on why I got this. And finally, we got the Tifton filter kit, which are just ND filters for the 50 millimeter lens because it's on a speed booster, which makes it too bright to film outside with an F 1.27 or whatever it is. But mission accomplished. We got our crap for B&H and what's cool about all this stuff, it's all under 50 bucks a piece. I think in total we spent something like right around $100 to get everything. And stay tuned for a few new videos going over each one of these products. Essential things you may need in your bag of camera goodies that are all under $50 a piece. And in this case, it's like 20 something dollars, really cheap. And as for B&H Photo, it's a big superstore here in New York City that pretty much has every piece of camera equipment you could ever imagine and dream of looking at. It's like Best Buy on steroids. Because you always go into Best Buy and you're just a little bit disappointed with their stuff. As far as camera stores and tech stores goes, B&H is one of my favorites, along with Adorama and a couple other places in the city. That is one of the benefits of living in New York City. We have access to stores like these. We just browse around look at stuff. I can take a walk from my office to there. No big deal at all. If you're ever in town, go buy B&H if you like camera equipment. Because it'll literally blow your mind. And that is not a plug for B&H. I'm not being paid to say this. I just like the store, it's not bad. And I loved myself today. How does this mic sound? Does it sound better? Let me know in the comments below. Do you like the way the lav sounds? I don't wanna put a shotgun mic up today. It's kind of annoying. I'd rather just put a mic in my shirt and a lav in my pocket. It runs wirelessly and I can walk around, the, walk around anywhere and get pretty good, decent sounding audio, I think. Let me know if it sounds okay. But that's all I have for today. Thank you for being here. Thank you for being a part of the channel. And uh, I will catch you guys in the next video. Mic drop. And why you may or may not need these things in your life. And why you may or may not. And why you... The subscribe button pops up. Can I, can I juggle these? Juggle, 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 juggle. I've only got 20 seconds for this part. Ah! Check this out. My chair goes up and down. Ah! Uh, 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 uh.